so the next thing we need to do is to make sure that we speed up our website increase the speed of our website this is very important when you want to make sure that your, your website competes with other websites and google also loves websites that are very fast the pages are very fast to load one of the reasons why your website will not load very fast load very fast uh, would be because the images you've used on your website or other graphics are too heavy or too large and other options could other reasons could be that uh, you know you have too much data on your website and it's not properly handled right so we are going to install a plugin that will help us with this job to compress all our images improve our website speed and also do some sort of catching catching is a way of um, storing data right so let's not go into the technicalities but we'll install a catching plugin that will help us to optimize our website for better speed just know that so to do that we'll just go back to dashboard so that you don't get confused and uh, go to plugins you can click here to add new plugin or do it from here if it opens add new plugin come here and type wp optimize wp optimized in this manner right and yeah this is the plugin click install great it has been installed so activate perfect so we should have the plugin somewhere here wp optimize okay but before you optimize our website let's check the website speed first so we'll go to a new page so go to gtmetrics.com gtmetrics.com type it correctly and we'll use this website to optimize the speed to check for the speed of our website so you can just type in your website url domain name there uh, come here and say here in this place type in this url and click on test website wait for it for some time it's going to scan your website and show you the speed of your website we are using this as a baseline right once we finish optimizing the website we will come back again to look at what has changed so give it some time it's going to scan your website and show you the data i'll be back good this is the um, performance performance is 51 percent uh, structure is 90 percent it means our navigation is fine lcp oms well whatever it means but make sure that once this place is red and red it means that that area is not so good right so let's go and work on our website to see whether we can change this to blue like this so we'll go with install the wp optimize plugin we'll just click here and say optimize and it says thank you for installing the plugin right so what we want to do is to run all selected optimization do not select anything you don't understand just leave it the way it is and um, they're selected by default run selected optimization so be watching these areas right for the eight post revisions deleted so wait until it completes this last area then we can continue i'll be back good it's complete so we are done with this area so go up here you'll see other areas here click on images you can click on this to dismiss this so we want to compress images and uh, make sure that our images work well right so just click on automatically compress added images so the next thing to click on before you compress your images will be prioritize retention of detail right this is going to help to compress your images but still you know um keep the data intact so just come here click on select all and um, come here and compress selected images and wait for it to compress your images depending on the images you have on your site it may take some time yes great so 
it has compressed all the images for us right so you just click on them either view lock or close but for now we'll just say close so if you notice that there are some images left here in this place you can just select all again and compress selected images again and just make sure that everything is compressed until nothing shows up here again so wait for it good this has happened so fast let's see if there are images here again okay so if we try this one time and the images does not does not compress it means that you know the compression has been done enough and there's no more compression to be done okay so we can leave this as, as it is so we will click on catch catch i can't pronounce this but that's what it is once you click on catch come here to enable page catch enable page catching here and um, come down here and click on generate separate files for mobile devices right and then scroll down and save changes then go up here and click on gzip compression right this has been compressed already so but it's good to check click on static file headers um, this has also become enabled already so i think we are done with this but we need to go back to the website we used to check our site right to see what's going to happen now take note this was 51 percent and all of that so we'll just tap here by this right corner to say retest and it's going to scan the website again let's see whether something has changed boom you see the site performance is now 100 percent isn't that great so it means that your site is now up and it's running very fast so these things are very important for your website to rank on search engines and also to be optimized to give webs um google adsense and other ad network the opportunity to get you approved very fast for monetization so that's it we are good with the site now if you want you can just go to your site and view it like view site yes so our images are still intact but they've been compressed right and you can see that the cookie button now appears on this side so our side makes sense and it's compliant see you in the next video